welcome back to my channel this is such a sad situation man because this happened to one of my subscribers peter spencer oh my god i started youtube from i was in my late 20s and peter subscribed to that youtube channel i'm in my early 40s now and peter is was there with me all my channels everybody knows i start the youtube channels get them monetized and then i sold them i stopped doing that now i don't do that anymore but peter always 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 there with me he don't you know often um leave a comment but he is always there all my youtube channel peter spencer i cannot believe you died in such a sad situation oh my god condolences to his family may his soul rest in peace and justice will be served there are calls for an arrest after jamaican immigrant was shot and killed in pennsylvania earlier this month the coroner in venango county said that the jamaican who is identified as peter spencer was shot several times a black empowered group is calling for answers from the authorities. The black empowered project wants answers because no charges have been filed. They say the murder should be considered a hate crime. Pennsylvania State Police said a 25-year-old man was taken into custody and multiple guns were located at the scene, but no charges have been filed. The news further stated that Peter received six bullets in his chest and two into his buttocks. Oh my God. According to, to Stevens, the spokesperson, he said that Peter's fiance dropped him off to go hunting in Venango County with a man he had visited in the past and several other white men. This time, he was taken directly into the woods and not this person's mother's house. So apparently Peter went hunting with this person before and, you know, they went to this person's mother's house. But this time now, this person along with his white friends took Peter directly into the woods and not at his mother's house. And to Peter's fiance, she didn't feel totally comfortable with that. And less than 24 hours when she went to pick up, when she went to pick up Peter, he was dead. And Stevenson, Stevens, who is the spokesperson, said that the man who was taken into custody claimed self-defense. So far, police have only re released an initial report and did not include any details about the suspect or possible motive. This is so difficult to read because I've never met Peter before, but it's like I met him before. You understand? That's how close we were. Man, Jesus. This is so difficult to read. People, please Google Peter Spencer name and read the rest of the story because I can't do no more. Trust me. Anyway, Peter's family has set up, a, set up two GoFundMe pages. You know, so one, ra one is to raise money for funeral expenses and the other one is for legal fees. This is so sad, man. Peter, Peter. Peter Spencer, man. <sighs> Thanks for watching.